Rev up your engines! It's time for StaticCharge.com! If you've been a bad boy or girl and let your cooling system get really corroded inside, then stay tuned because I'm going to show you how to flush out a cooling system today. Now the first thing to do is get a drain pan and throw it under the car. Then you want to remove the radiator hose that's where the thermostat sits on the Toyota it's right here under the alternator. Just unscrew the clamp and pull the hose off and off it goes. Then remove the thermostat to get better flow and in this car you got to take the oil filter off because it's in the way of one of the bolts. So put on your oil filter removing tool, stick it on and uh, loosen it up. Then the filter just comes off by hand and you get it out of the way. Now we can go over here and access the last bolt that holds the thermostat housing and take that off. It's the only way there's room. Then pull out the thermostat housing, take the thermostat out and throw it away. Then put the housing back on and you'll have full flow when you flush it with a hose. And don't forget to put the oil filter back on too. Now first we're going to flush the engine block so we'll take the other radiator hose off We'll just pull it off here and then get a garden hose. And with the hose, wrap a little towel around it first so it'll fit in the hose snug, and then shove it in the hose. Then when you squeeze the hose, it flushes out the engine block. Now you want to back flush it too, so take one of the hoses off the radiator and put it back where the thermostat housing is and flush it backwards. Just stick the hose right on here. Uh. And then on the other end, squirt the water. Then it'll back flush it out the other way. You do it until the clear water flows out like this. It's nice and clean. Then do the same thing with the radiator. Get a radiator hose and stick it on the top radiator. Then get your hose and towel, stick it in, and spray it through. This is flushing the radiator out. And after you flush it one way, then go to the other radiator hose that goes to the bottom and flush it through that hose. Just stick your hose and the towel again in here and flush it backwards. Now when you're done flushing, here's a tip that I've been doing for years. Just put water in it and leave the thermostat out until later. Because you want to drive the car for a week or two and driving it will also help flushing it out while you drive. Then if everything's fine after a week or two, Put the thermostat back in and put a mixture of 50% coolant and 50% water in the system. So now you know how to flush out a dirty cooling system. Wasn't that hard, was it? And remember, if you've got any car questions, just visit scottykilmer.com.